It's a brand new day here at Tenpenny Tower, and uh, boy, I don't know. I would surely have perished if it wasn't for Mr. Tenpenny uh, and his tower. Are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> wow, Tenpenny Tower looks so much nicer with a little decoration on the walls, doesn't it? Yeah, and, and fewer people around. Yeah. Can't smell the stink of ghoul on anybody right now. What the so, hell? You better not cause tight. any more trouble. Thank you. They're singing a better tune now. They're realizing this place isn't all it's cracked up to be. Yeah, I've killed enough people that they're like, wow, I guess trouble. I don't really like Ten Penny Tower anymore. <laughs> what are yeah. you doing, Clover? You Fucking well, stupid. <laughs> Clover, that's not a stepper. <laughs> oh, that you is a stepper. <laughs> exercise on that, you dipshit. Holy shit, what the fuck are you... What's your problem? Do you always make that face oh when our back is turned? She's infuriated. So, anyways, think a ghoul, and um, I'm gonna head out now. You've got mail. Oh wait, what the hell? Hold on a second. I finally set up my email on my Pip Boy, so now I can get messages from people. So, anyway, here's the email from Baron Nate. This is really interesting. So, if I go talk to Sydney, I can get that upside down SMG she always carries around. Let me out, asshole. I'm on. He doesn't know what to say. <laughs> How long till you get Facebook up and running? I think the ghouls are on Facebook, but they're the main ones who are on there, so I don't even want to go yeah, on Yeah, you can't... Oh, God. Hey, add me on Faceless Book. Can you get the fuck away from me immediately? Come on, baby. Don't you want to go to my place? Oh, my God. Your breath smells like 100-year-old shit. You can apply cream to my scabs. That would take a lot of cream. I know. Off to Underworld. See, my old... Old gal Sydney. Yeah, she's like your best friend. She actually. really is, actually. I should form like a group of awesome women that run around and take care of business in the wasteland. Oh. It could be called like the Sisterhood of Steel. That sounds pretty <laughs> cool, doesn't it? The Sisterhood of Traveling Steel Pants. <laughs> Great idea. Me, my slave Clover, Sydney. Sydney. Good hunting. You can't be in the sisterhood of traveling metal pants. I mean, steel, or whatever we're called. What the fuck are you, the shithead twins? Excuse me. Oh! Man, I need to take a picture of this and put it on no Facebook. <laughs> the Ninth Circle, this has gotta be the place. Sydney's not gonna expect this. Check check me out, check me out. Hey, it's me, Sydney, but you didn't expect me to show up here, yes. here at the bar, did you? Well, 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 <laughs> if it isn't the greatest American hero. That's me. I figured we'd bump into each other yeah, again. Yeah, and then we're not gonna bump some uglies into each other again, yeah, too. You know what I'm lots saying? Of bumping. Mm. What have you been up to there, honey baby pork lump? I've used the proceeds from our last acquisition to set myself up as an ammunition vendor. We needed an ammo vendor in the sisterhood of the steel traveling metal nuts, so that's really good. Well, it was good to see you, Sydney. Bye. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. That's not very nice, Sydney. God, you didn't tell me anything either about that gun. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, I'm getting another email. Okay, Riley's Rangers, hmm. But if I want Sydney to join the sisterhood, I gotta, I gotta go do this. She's playing hard to get right now. I can tell that she, you know, you heard her say whatever. Yeah, I She's not that. gonna join unless we go do this for her, so. Long time no see, what's going on with you? Not much, just uh, looking like a regular human, not a freak. <laughs> Avoiding ghouls, mostly. Oh, Riley is not a ghoul? Nope. She's oh. a girl. That's hot. She's a sexy girl and must be protected. <laughs> Wake the hell up, Riley. What? Where am I? I just rubbed your tummy and gave you a kiss. What happened? Woke you up like Sleeping Beauty. How long beauty. have I been out? Sleeping Riley. And mm -hmm. by tummy, she means cock pocket. Is that like something heat up in the microwave? You know, like a sausage wallet. Or a hair pie. Those don't sound like real food, Emery. <laughs> Cock pocket! Oh, Riley, you've been out for centuries. The planet's a lush green paradise once again, and everybody gives me a kiss whenever I ask for it and touches my genitals. Huh? What the hell are you talking <laughs> no, about? No, seriously. Oh, come that on, it is too funny. funny. It's hilarious. If my guys were here, they'd kick your... Yeah, probably. Oh, yeah. shit. My uh, you know what? I don't want no guys what kicking my ass happened? anymore. That's why I'm starting up the sisterhood of the traveling medical pants. I mean, med metal pants. Me yeah, metal. Are you tired of guys kicking the shit out of everybody? Riley? Yeah. Have you been hurt in an accident? Well, then you should join the Sisterhood of the Traveling Metal Pants. We protect you from all t sorts of men. Large men, small men, men with big dicks, men with no dicks. Men with tiny 
Uh, okay, I'm getting off track here. Sorry, <laughs> Riley. I don't think you're in any condition to be up and about, bitch. My team is trapped on the roof of the Statesman Hotel in Vernon Square and completely surrounded by super mutants. <sighs> What's the easiest way to get over to this pile of fuck? Your best bet is to stay with the metro tunnels. Yeah. Let me ask you about something else. Okay, go ahead. I have to go now. Watch yourself. <laughs> really Wasn't really a ass. question. Oh, God, did you hear that? <laughs> he probably actually uh, coughed up a lung. You ever been to Ghoul Karaoke? Oh, man. Mm -hmm. I would love to hear them sing Dreamweaver. Dreamweaver. <laughs> oh, there goes his head. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> oh my god, it's stuck to that building back there! Dude, that was like a football field's length. I'm pretty sure that's an NFL record. I think so. Alright, back to business. Where's the Metro... oh, this? You oh. haven't discovered it yet. Oh. Oh. Where? Uh. Clover, can you use a different escalator, please? <laughs> the... Not fair! She has a sword! <laughs> Mommy, she poked me. No super mutant son of mine's gonna act like a pussy. <laughs> Go clean up your room. I want all your gore bags put in your gore box. <laughs> son, I'm out of mutilated torsos. Do you have any extras? Mom, those are my mutilated torsos! Well, give them to your mother now. I need them. I'm cleaning the kitchen. No, I was gonna trade them to Eric for some mutilated lungs. You stay away from that Eric boy. He doesn't have any gore bags in his house at all. You can't trust a mutant like that. Oh, it's good to see you, too! Looks like he's about to start dancing. <laughs> oh, Shot him right yeah. in the palm! Now, who would have put bear traps out like this? An ancient subway fur trader? <laughs> who, uh, you know, catches subway bears? <laughs> While they're congregating for their annual parades? Hey, this guy used to be a pitcher for the, uh... San Diego... Padres. Padres. Uh, <laughs> oh, this, and this was the relief pitcher for the San Diego Padres. Here we go. Oh. Nice. Oh, the baby exploded. <laughs> oh. Was that a real baby? Yeah. Oh, this one's not, doesn't have an exploding baby in it. It's not ocupado. I didn't know you could speak Spanish. <laughs> it's a lot you don't know about me. I know how to how to speak German too. Really? Danke, meine Führer. What does that mean in English? It means thank you, good sir. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm gonna try that in my friends. Danke schön. That means uh, I think that means Hitler. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh I... Emery, it's your favorite people. <laughs> 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 now that was not a very smart centaur. <laughs> Look at him get up. Oh, Where? I made a mistake. Go ahead, Clover. You can take this guy. Does he have a mustache? He's up? slapping her. Okay, fine. I better do something, I guess. I don't think she likes being touched like that. <laughs> no, I don't think so. <laughs> He's giving her a lady job. Wow, she really pissed at him. Oh, finally, the Statesman Hotel. I see they've rolled out the large steel girder for us. All right, so we just have to get up to the roof of this place. Oh, that's a queen-size bed. Very specific. Hey, just enough room for both of us, Clover. How about it? Have some wild, passionate nothing? <laughs> <laughs> Uh-oh, trouble. Clover, back up. <laughs> Good job, dumbass. Jeez. I, s fucking <laughs> I don't know about you. <laughs> you oh, wow, this hotel's awful. I'm gonna definitely write a negative review of this place on Yelp. This hotel, which is just run by seven foot tall green mutant people, yeah. really impolite. Not a single ice machine in sight. And then the the maid service is just these weird fuckers with three six foot long tongues. Oh, they're disgusting. Spiraling all over the place. And they can't even speak English. No, and they just try to lick you. Yeah. Speaking of how awful it is, look at here's a. Check out the skeleton in the bed. Just, you just skeleton on my bed. What am I supposed to I mean, do about that? Uh, I don't want to sleep in this bed. Oh, no. what's this? It's uh, a note for Moon Moonbeam. Oh my God! This is Sydney's father. Not only is it a dead person in my bed, but it's somebody that I know. It's somebody's father that I know. <laughs> well, I'll give this to Sydney, and she'll uh, she'll become a part of the uh, warriors of the silky metal pantaloon. 
That's the noise they should make. Whenever they walk, they should go.